suppose it's a bit like sort of saying that you're, you know, if you're a painter and you work with canvas or, you know, or, or oils or whatever it is you work with, sort of, you know, my base is, is gold. Drew Jewelry had a life that's, I think it's probably been quite unusual. It started really with Tracy Emin. She had a newspaper column, The Independent, and it was basically her world, whatever she was up to. She was going to Australia and she asked a few creative people that she knew to do that every week, the column. Very, very nervous about doing it because I'd not really had anything that was going to go and get read, but I did it and I really loved it. I started to kind of just keep blogs. Sometimes we would put them out on the website, other times not. Somebody showed it to the publisher and they were really keen to publish it. My life and jewellery are sort of like entwined because I've been my whole adult life a jeweller now 40 years. As a jeweller you 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 sort of you can't escape the fact that you're you're working in precious material. You're sort of you're always conscious of the fact that this is very valuable. You know, it's, it tends not to be sort of super feminine or, or kind of like soft edges. It's, it's got a bit of edge to it. I like to bring to the table things that perhaps another jeweler wouldn't look to for inspiration. It's up to them how that's inspiring. And I think for me, I'm, I'm sort of always looking for something that, you know, it can be just a little bit challenging, a little bit intriguing. And uh, I always try to apply that to my designs. So the drink we're going to make is a twist on the Ramos Gin Fizz. One of our Christmas drinks is called The Shining. It's to talk about some of our Christmas cocktails that are on offer over this festive period. So it's 40 ml Bombay Sapphire, nice dash of slow gin, dark Christmas flavours from the slow berries, lemon juice, a little dash of egg white, and some plum essence. Give that a good shake, a fancy little touch to lift up ice cube. Soda. My name is Gemma, and today we are in Moisey Stevens on Regent Street. Welcome you to the Fresco Bar del Restaurante on Regent Street. Um, I will be presenting uh, my Christmas cocktail, which is called the Winter's Tale. The first ingredient I'm going to use is Johnny Walker Black. The next, uh, cherry herring liqueur. The next ingredient I'm using is strega. Strega is like a herbal liqueur. The next ingredient is amaretto. Then we'll be using agave nectar honey. I'm going to put four drops of um, chocolate bitters, two drops of orange bitters. And hot water which is infused with cloves. Also we garnish the cocktail with a cinnamon stick as well. And then we'll be using this which is a homemade green and black butter scotch and coffee foam. Also um, some chocolate sprinkles which go over the top. Then we use some cinnamon powder which we light. We'll be using um, sparkly, sprinkly snow, blended notes of nutmeg and cinnamon with cardamom, a hint of black pepper, and a zesty twist of tangerine. We're finishing off by toasting some marshmallows. 